Welcome to Yoga Capital of the World, Rishikesh. Too much energy. Welcome to AYM Yoga School, Rishikesh, the birthplace of yoga. Namaste, my name is Chell, I'm from Canada, Toronto, and I just finished my 200 hours uh, yoga teacher training, and the past one month has been absolutely amazing. So, hello, my name is Emma, I, I am from Sweden, but I live in Switzerland. Aloha, my name is Karana Sovangs and I'm from Honolulu, Hawaii and I'm here studying my 200 hours of uh, registered yoga teacher training here at AYM. My name is James, I'm from Australia and I live in Sydney. My name is Felicia Solak, I am from New York City, New York, United States of America and I came to AYM to further develop my studies in yoga. Um. But to be honest, before I got here, I was really skeptical towards, you know, training in India and all this stuff. I wasn't really sure if it's going to be a good time. And but when I got here, and I realized the environment is amazing, and it rains the whole time. We stay in the mountain forest. The oxygen is really good, and the people here are very, very friendly. I found the teachers are are very humble. Uh, you can raise the, your question every time, and they're very friendly and in the, in the end we all become good friends and the students all from you know they come from all over the world and uh, it's you know a lot of diversity here and my favorite part of the training I would say the meditation because before I was only uh, I was only engaged in the sort of mindfulness meditation but the pranayama meditation teacher here shows us a lot of ways to do meditation for example the guided meditation and uh, there's one time we did uh, the om meditation everybody just circle around and we start om chanting and everybody start seeing different colors <laughs> Before joining AYM, I had very little experience. Um, I did some practice in Ashtanga Yoga and that was three months in the Korean temple and I enjoyed it uh, very much and I um, decided that I was going to come here and study a little bit more about yoga. Set the right foot forward, inhale, Yes, of course yoga is for everyone. There's always, I mean, anyways, you can do yoga without moving also, so <laughs> it doesn't matter how restricted you are in movement. Yoga, I think, can be something, should be something for everyone. It should be something very valuable for everyone. It just depends on how you, you just have to present it in the right way, because it's very logical that it makes sense. And with the movement you can modify everything, so people have the tendency to think that it's only for very flexible, very strong people, which is completely not the truth. course we learn a lot about uh, how to breathe and different um, techniques and styles in breathing where the yogis and the rishis have um, passed down from generations to generations so we learned about the different um, many different types of styles and breathing techniques
I really like the class, how the class are organized. They start with easy postures and then they slowly and gently move on to the hard postures. Because me as a, as a beginner yoga practitioner, I wasn't really sure if I could do some of the advanced yoga asanas. But then, you know, the way how they organize it completely helped me to cope with the situation. Elongating, exhaling, bending knees this way, gentle back bending this way. You go there, inhale, exhale, I skip Chaturanga or going down, and then inhale, exhale. Big challenge. It was a lot of work. I was pretty tired, pretty exhausted close towards the end of it, but now that, that I'm finished, everything was so worth it, and I'm happy to have gone through the 300 TTC here at UIM. This is just for you, so you should enjoy every class and find your ways to enjoy it. And uh, even a little bit going towards the border is something that we can enjoy when we get used to it. And otherwise, just always listen to your body and make it the way that it's pleasant. Left hand up to the ceiling. Stretch up. Wide. Hasta the seat. Do not drop your shoulder. Up. Four stand. Five. Vegan food helped me to cope with diarrhea and it also helped me to get rid of my pimples. They're awesome. Play some fanatic music and everybody start dancing you know on the spot it's just it's just we all have a really really good time it's really eye-opening experience <laughs> the wonderful rain here yeah. <laughs> to cool Woo. ourselves down because in Rishikesh at least in the summer the rain is warm yeah it's still warm it's refreshing <laughs> thank you so much for having me here in the school and I look forward to uh, returning back in the future Aloha Doomsay Milga Baha Achalaga